We often face this phenomenon in our lives. However, we hardly ever notice it. But if you pay more attention, you will see the dispersion always accompanied. For example, it manifests itself in a rainbow. I bet you will not find a person who has never admired the rainbow. At first sight, the rainbow may seem very simple for you. However, it includes complex physical processes. Dispersion of light stands for ratio between the light refraction factor and the light wavelength. Newton's prism experiment, as part of which the light is decomposed into a spectrum using a trihedral prism, experimentally proves the phenomenon of dispersion. Newton proved that if white light passes through a glass prism, it will decompose into seven rainbow colors, i.e. red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. This means that white light is not actually white, vice versa, it includes all the above colors. Dispersion occurs as light rays with different wavelengths propagate in transparent substances, i.e. optical environment at different speeds. Generally, the smaller wavelength is, the greater the refraction factor and the small light speed will be. In candesite solid and fluid bodies, you the continuous spectrum, while in candesite gases, you the discrete spectrum, typical of such substances only. Then you see light is white, but the world is colorful.